In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the current download update error on your Samsung phone. So if you were trying to update your phone or update some applications and you got this error, then the cause behind the problem could be related to the software or maybe some storage issue. So here's what you can try. The first thing you need to make sure is to enable mobile data or Wi-Fi. You need either of these for the update to happen. And also you need at least 50% charge on your phone. Otherwise, the update will not happen because your phone will automatically block the update. Make sure to charge your phone above 50% and enable either Wi-Fi or mobile data. After that, we can try the advanced solutions. The first solution would be enabling the Wi-Fi scan throttling. For this, we need to go to our settings application, scroll down to about phone and tap on it. Scroll down once again and here tap on software information. From this page, you have to tap on your phone build number seven times. Eventually, the developer mode option will be enabled. So go back and go back again. And here is the developer options. Tap on this and scroll down until you find the Wi-Fi scan throttling feature. So here's the feature, make sure to enable this and also enable mobile data always active if you use mobile data. And after that, you can also toggle them off and on again for the settings to refresh. And once that's done, see if that fixes the problem or not. If the issue does not get fixed, then you can also turn off the auto update system. So search for the auto update system and if you can't find it, then simply basically search for it. So in the developer options, you have this auto update system option So simply tap on it and it will guide you to this. Now just toggle this feature to the off position. After that, your phone will apply updates when the phone automatically restarts. So whenever your phone restarts, it will get the update available. And so without any delay, you'll just restart your phone after this and hopefully your problem will be gone. But in case your problem is persisting, then it could mean that there is not enough storage on your phone. So in case what you can do is you can get out from developer options and then over up to settings again. Scroll down to device care. Tap on it. Never mind. So on device care, you have to see that how many storage you have available. You can go to the storage option and see if you want to delete any storage that you don't need anymore. You go to show more and we're just going to delete all the images or videos that you don't need. And after deleting or clearing up the files that you don't need anymore, the problem will be gone. And I think you'll be able to update your phone easily. And guys, that's basically it. If you found this tutorial helpful, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe to this channel. Thanks a lot for watching.